What's up guys, J-Man here, and today we're doing some more NHL news. There's going to be two parts to this. It's been a while since I've done one. I got a haircut, of course, like two hours ago. So, one of these, I, I'm i surprised with all of these. I'm not surprised with any of these, except for one. So, first, you can tell by the title of this video, Ryan Johansson gets eight year, six, uh, $64 million from, I mean, con extension. Okay, Ryan Johansson gets an eight year, $64 million contract extension with the Nashville Predators. Who my second favorite team, Pittsburgh, beat in the finals. And I am going to get a McDavid jersey soon. I hope. I agree with this. He'll be 32 by the time his contract ends. He still that means he's like 24 right now. This is the one I'm surprised with. Andre Markov will not return to the Montreal Canadiens and is off to the KHL. Canadian should have brought him back. Just because you got Kyle Osner doesn't mean you have to leave Markov. He could have been top top four at least. Could have just traded him to Ottawa last year. Last year we didn't need him. This year we definitely need a better defenseman. But we got him and uh, well we got a defenseman on Julia. Oh Julia, I'm just getting off topic now. I'm surprised with this. Next one. The Boston Bruins signed Ryan Spooner to a one-year deal. I hate talking about the Boston Bruins so much. I hate them. Johnny Gaudreau wants to go to the Philadelphia Flyers. <laughs> but he said he's, he loves Calgary, and he said he wanted to go to the Philadelphia Flyers. Stay with him. Stay with Sean Monahan right here. He needs the freaking help. I've seen Sean Monahan play a lot of times. If he, if you, if you go a good passer, we can. I mean, the Calgary Flames could lose that. The, he's not go. In, the, in my opinion, he's not going anywhere. Next, the New York Rangers will try to trade defenseman Nick Holden. Right there. Oh, Dooley is only signed for one year. I don't even know how much he's signed for, but we can need we need we can use him for a defense since Mark Mathot's gone. Trade Nick Holden to the Ottawa Senators for like a prospect and a draft pick in this year's draft. Another New York Rangers. The New York Rangers sign old Ottawa Senator Mika Savinajad. For twenty-six point seventy-five million dollars, five years. He should be getting more than this. A lot more. Last piece of news for this part: the Buffalo Sabers avoid a bar abbreviation, or however you call it, with Robin Leonard, an old auto center, for one year, four million dollars. He should be getting paid at least five million, five point five million. Uh, he should. Last piece of news, also from the Ottawa Senators, Chris Neal has. Well, he's not in the Ottawa Senators anymore because they're not going to bring him back. Has faith that he will play in the NHL during fall. I mean, in fall is when the NHL season starts. Seventy-one days until the NHL season starts, but for the Ottawa Senators, seventy-two. I can't wait seventy-two days. I need to see some hockey. So, that's all I have for this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Remember, like, subscribe, go subscribe to Andrew's Vlogs. Comment what was on the scene online. I'm out. Peace.